If there's one thing that we New Yorkers hold dear, it's our bagels. But I live in LA now, and the bagels aren't horrible. So what is it about a New York bagel? Are they really that much better than LA bagels? Is it the recipe, the water? Is it just plain nostalgia? Well, I came to the bagel broker in LA to find out. What specific qualities should someone look for in a great bagel? The first experience should be a nice, good crunch, and it should get softer and softer as you get to the middle of the bagel. And the ingredients and the flavor is a big thing that you gotta work with. A lot of people would say that LA bagels, not as good as New York bagels. That would be a statement made by New Yorkers, but I think it's just been ingrained in New Yorkers' heads from when they were children that bagels are New York and pizza's New York. Nothing compares. To test this theory, I'm gonna get six bagels. I picked up LA bagels from the bagel broker. Noah's New York bagels and Sam's bagels. Got the last of the LA bagels. Then I have bagels shipped from my childhood bagel place, Bagel Boss in New York. Now, six New Yorkers are going to see if they could choose the New York bagel. What are we looking at here? That aesthetically is very pleasing to me, but I realize it's just melted cheese on top. Flat, kind of a weird texture. There should be a very tiny hole here, but the fact that I can see through both of these, like eye goggles, not good. It's not New York bagel. Oh, you can smell the jalapenos in yeah, this one. Pretty... I like a lot of cream cheese on my bagel. Me too. My grandma like, that's a nice healthy schmear of cream cheese. <laughs> it has LA bagel written all over it. I mean, I'm eating it, but it's not that great. It's edible, but it's not New York. Agreed. 100% agreed. But I do want a little bit of it. Okay. What? So these are shriveled. Are these cranberries and rye seeds or something? The hole here is a oh, little bit smaller. Go. See? I can't really put my finger through it that time. It seems like the New York bagel is something that like really can't be f***ed with, you know? I don't know that they're about introducing new kooky flavors. Oh my god, even trying to rip it apart is awful. It feels cold and sad. I feel cold in my f***ing soul. <laughs> Do you think it's a New York bagel? Oh man, I don't know. I feel like I have to taste all of them and then decide. I know. These seem very LA to me. You could just look at it and know that it was made in LA. I don't think this is a New York bagel. Why are you eating more of it? I don't know, because I'm upset. <laughs> this is an egg bagel, and this is definitely a New York f***ing bagel. What? What is that? <gasps> see, see how wide this is? This is what a New York bagel is. These raisins are Weird. It's got that a fluffy feel to it. You can smell it from afar. Different like, colored raisins, I don't know. This reminds me of Breaking Fast at Yom Kippur. <laughs> it's better. better. The flavor of the, of the seeds are definitely coming through after as an aftertaste. It actually tastes pretty good though. There's a density. It's alive. I'm choking up, it's so good. I'm gonna lean towards New York. I don't know, that. the raisins alone will make me say like, no, it's from LA. I'm not ready to say that this is from New, from New York though. It makes me homesick for New York. I miss New York really badly. This one looks promising. I'm suddenly doubting everything I said about the other bagels. This is it, I can just feel by touching Together. it. Look at that. Together. Those raisins look normal. And I like the swirl. Size, look at that, squishiness. See, small holes. There's like no comparison. Mm -hmm. It's got the look, it's got the feel. There's something just a little bit off that I can't put my finger on. Mm. None of these are really like jumping out at me as the bagel of my childhood. I really thought the one before was a New York bagel, but this could be a New York bagel as well, but it might be an imposter. What I'm saying is that the last bagel is a New York bagel. The swirl is telling me something. I'm gonna have to go with the last one too. Number three. Yeah, I have to go with three. Three is a New York bagel. I'm going with three. Please tell me I'm right. New York bagel. I'm nervous. Come on, RS. Number four. Whoa! You guys. Stay in New Yorkers because you guys. Oh yes. my god, I'm, I'm so, so happy. happy. <laughs> my grandmother's turning over in her grave. What happened to it in travel, man? LA bagels just aren't the same. When you're eating a New York bagel, you just know. Mm -hmm. You just know.